Susin versus Mathur. How to deal with Chopper? Susin never lost to Defender. Why? Susin eats Defender for breakfast. Because of the ability to attack all the ball with his forehand, the strength of the pen holder, and the ability to vary the speed of the loop, one soft slow top spin and one fast loop kill. That is what every defender scares the most. Today, let's see how Su Xin deal with Ma Te, one of the best defenders of China nowadays. Let's see the replay of this point and you understand the tactics used by Su Xin. Susin's first attack is the slow but spinny loop. This kind of loop is a safe option to deal with the first job and service. You can also see the ability, the footwork of Susin, that he can use his forehand to attack the ball everywhere on the table. And this is the second loop of Susin. The second loop is also a slow and safe attack, but now Susin attack to the wide backhand corner of the defender. Why? Because Susin wants to force the defender away from the table. That is why Susin changed the direction. If the defender is too far from the table, his return, his chop is weaker and closer to the net. This is the third loop. When realizing that the chop is weak and close to the net, Susin decided to use the loop Q to attack strongly the ball on the bounce to finish the point. So what is the tactics here? Be patient. Don't attack hard the first ball. You know that you can't win the defender with just one attack, right? And you save slow top spin to deal with his chop, his serve. Aim to the consistency of your loop. The main objective is to vary the placement and to push the defender far away from the table. Force him to return with his weak ball. So what is the weak ball for you? The weak ball is the ball which is returned too high or too close to the net or with less spin. And now use the loop cue, hit the ball very hard and fast to finish the point. By understanding these tactics, you won't lose to the defender unless he is way more consistent and smarter than you. <coughs>这个球，这个球难度很大，这个手腕力量，漂亮，控制好，漂亮，那冲出来变线，这个真的是不容易，好球，啊，这个这批运动员来说，你哪怕差距再远，你每一次比赛，天津现在这支队伍呢，是大概
好交好交，有点，好交好交。你许昕的这个弧圈拉上来以后，你不是没有反击的机会。关键你要抓住都是人家，包括刚才马特这个球回的就是侧面侧身以后，就是整个感觉这个身体没过来，也没往前的动作，完全没往前，和许昕比还是有相当的差距。商坤的实力也也相当强，对吧？他每个人特别高出一筹，实际上坤跟他比，他可能就是一一倍的使劲蛮劲，但是许昕呢就是很精神，那个长的很好啊，好球。这两精彩精彩，很好，这两漂亮，很好。这球被许昕抓住了，哎，到台内球呢又高了一点，对，许昕马上就抓住。许昕刚才真是表演了一个超一流的球，他这个球其实观赏性很强。是，我们其实看乒乓球像这种一手一攻，漂亮，再来。他这个哥的这个球呢，一般人稍微实力差一点的话。容易什么呢？容易这看不清他的，看不清选择。对对对,对，他这把球就就是横的拉了一把。哎，那我们注意一下，就是打削球这个马特呢，他反手的这个胶皮性能是不一样的。啊，其实声音也挺。这接发球这个用这个反手乱长胶啊，确实是有一定危险的。一般的不适应的选手啊，这很难搞的。居然还能摩擦透了以后上来，真漂亮！漂亮！你看这身体，真漂亮！今天我觉得打的许昕呢没有任何压力，对，啊，对吧？这个这个就这样，漂亮，好球，哎，对，真漂亮，哦，漂亮的老将，然后再来，这帮这个这帮过渡以后，时间把对方的这个节，呃、嗯，许昕很少用吊放短球的。因为许昕打成这样，那么你其实碰见其他人你也不怕。对，没有多少人有许昕这么好的这个正手。他现在这个天津到目前为止只有胜了两场，但这两在这个呃十个超级俱乐部当中，嗯，你是以削球说，刚才连连着连，有前面一局也是，他侧身以后其实很好机会，啊，但是都下网没打了。他的攻击力，你明显回来以后，朱世坤的上步也很快，抓得很紧。漂亮啊！就他刚刚那把球还是手里蛮有数的，嗯，干净又放开了。